If you are using a Foscam C1 uh, IP camera, chances are that uh, you are not getting uh, a very sharp image because uh, some of uh, these cameras are uh, not uh, perfectly focused. So today I'm going to show you how to uh, adjust the focus and uh, correct it so that uh, you will get uh, a very sharp image from it, which is uh, possible. So I'm going to show you how to take it apart first. As you can see on the back, there are no screws and uh, neither on uh, its size, uh, sides. Sorry. So to take it apart, it's very easy. You are going to need a straight screwdriver, which you are going to insert. If you see here, it has a small notch and you will just make a bit of space like this. And the cap is pried open. Uh, take uh, care not to pull it apart as uh, it has uh, the microphone wired to it and takes a small bug out and now you have uh, separated the front plate the microphone from the rest of the camera inside you can see here it's the infrared array the peer sensor um, night detector this is the photodiode to activate the LEDs, the network uh, status and camera status, there are all on uh, this under the black cover. This is the Wi Fi antenna here to adjust uh, the lens. You can see here is the lens assembly. There are some uh, spots of uh, glue on its size, sides, so you can. Uh, push them a bit with a screwdriver it's a soft plastic it's not a thermal plastic so you just push it a bit now if i try to twist on the lens you can see the lens is moving so we can now adjust it uh, to have a good sharpness you are going to use a focusing pattern and a strong uh, light source I'm gonna use this bike light as it has the power of a small sun now I'm going to plug in the power to the camera and wait for it to start and I'm also going to use uh, my laptop to connect uh, to the camera so I can assess the image quality. Now I'm going to open uh, a browser and go to the camera's IP and I'm going to log in. And now I have image from the camera. I don't know if you can see but the image is uh, not too uh, sharp. I'm gonna try to zoom in but first uh, be sure to select the highest resolution here and also you can check in uh, the settings at video at video settings you can uh, verify here to have uh, greatest resolution and uh, highest bitrate so that you'll get the best image quality and now I'm going to turn on the light like this okay uh, I'm gonna also zoom in for you to see here's the pattern the pattern is installed at uh, around uh, one and a half meters distance of the camera and now I'm going to start to twist on the lens slowly until I see the pattern and you can see it's getting better and better and we can do a bit more than that something like this so now you can see the pattern and the rest of the details I'm gonna turn off the light here you go much better from uh, what was at the beginning so with light no light and now 
we need to put the camera back and that's about it.